So imagine the red curtains and then the black behind it. It's kind of nice. That's kind of nice, right? Meet Travis. He came up with the idea for Late Night Republic and is the show's director. What we need to do is actually come to the decision today, right now. Meet Jeff. He's the show's executive producer and one of the only people in the room with real television experience. Travis and Jeff are trying to create a democracy in late night, and one man stands in their way. So we started Late Night Republic uh, May 2008. No, what am I saying? May 2009, we started Late Night Republic together. 2010. May 2010, we started Late Night Republic together. Uh, Even after three I years, Jake and Travis don't always see eye to eye on the creative vision of the show. Well, we see Late Night Republic being something that a lot of, an ecosystem where a lot of things A lot of people will be involved in my half hour. Not only in your half hour. A lot of jobs well, created. It's our half stimulus. hour. It's our half hour. Yeah, so I think, I think that level of interactivity, but wait, what's the next question? What's but wait, there's more. <laughs> what is unique about uh, oh, Late yeah. Night Republic? So what I want to talk about was- Here he is! I have no problem saying I'm a megalomaniac. I'm actually okay with it. You're a great part of this machine. Key part of the machine. You are a key part of the machine. I just would like to be able to spread my wings creatively. I think Jake's concern has been that he will be left behind. I don't want to be left behind. I have abandonment issues from when I was five. I don't have time to get booted out of my own show. You're not really an interviewer. You're... I'm a personality. Yeah. I am the we benefactor really, to humanity. We don't really know what that means, I mean, on camera. I, I'm a one-take wonder. That's who I am. Well, I'm a leader. <laughs> That's just what a leader does. You're really not equipped to do the job that you are doing, and I've embraced that. I think I am. Because I'm not either. I don't know how to do what Jake doesn't do. memorize lines. He does not rehearse. He's starting to rehearse. Uh, he is often uncomfortable with his wardrobe. Oh my goodness, it's the Red Baron. I kind of love these, actually. He's not actually a comedian at all, doesn't belong on television. He's really an everyman. And that's the reason he's so perfect. I'm not in everyman, I am an everyman. He's an example of someone who really should not be on television.